It's Tuesday morning, breakfast was good. Now we're gonna head north towards Bakersfield and see what kind of trouble we can get into up there. And Mrs. Millennial Farmer still won't let me drive. changed in a hurry. Yeah, I doubt they speak English, but if we introduce ourselves, they maybe let us watch. That is dusty. We're going to wait for them to get to this end of the field, but I was going to go over here and read the sign. VM Farms, no trespassing. We'll see if these guys speak any English. I have very little Spanish. My Spanish at best is horrible. That is some really light dirt compared to what I'm used to. Go talk to them. I don't think they want to talk, they want to work. Yeah, they're just running subsurface irrigation. Yeah, now we got it. Oh, that's cool. Inglés? No? Mi español es muy poco. Uh, soy, soy un granero de Minnesota. Me llamo Zach. Gracias. they're gonna be planting in that field but they were working they were pretty skittish they didn't like the camera we're gonna get out and walk in this though carrots carrots that's what, kind of what I thought they look like they're big aren't they it's wet. wow that's wet down there. they're so thick they must knife them out kind of like kidneys huh It's all sprinkler headed too. This is different line than what they're running. Cause it's got, there's steel pipes underneath there that stay above the ground. Oh, I can't believe how wet it is and it still just falls apart. I mean, that's like a sandbox. Oh, that's cool. Disking something up. Yeah, carrots. Oh my gosh. Then there's a carrot field right there that I wonder if they're getting right close if they're in harvest right now. Onions on, onions on the other side of the road. They double roll those onions. Yeah, there's nothing that says we can't take it. Grapes, probably, huh? Wow, that is a lot of trees. Wonder how many trees they got per acre here. Government insect trap. These trees are a lot bigger than I thought. Like the, the base of them, the trunks are big. I don't know uh, what I'm doing here, guys. I'm sure there's tons of guys watching this that know exactly what they're looking at. But I don't, other than some citrus trees. Looking at the irrigation lines, and I don't know why these ones are not harvested, but three rows over they are. 
They appear to me to be the same trees. Incredibly diverse. Everything. I don't I didn't really know they had cotton down here. Wow, that's a thick plant. I've never stood in a cotton field. Coyotes, that plane got him wound up. Are they radishes? Beets. Beets? I think they're a table beet, if I were to guess. Unless they're white inside, then it may be a radish. But... I guess by the dark red, it's a table beet. The stain yeah. There. Huh. We're in the southern tip of Bakersfield now. We haven't found anyone to talk to about anything as far as farming goes, but that's all right. We're having fun anyway. I don't know what I'm looking at here. Somebody watching this does. But we're going to drive around a little bit more and then probably find somewhere to eat some lunch. And then uh, maybe you, we'll maybe just find somewhere, stop somewhere and uh, talk to somebody that would would know and can tell us where we should go. Pretty cool. The destination is on your right. Kern Machinery. Kern Machinery. Arrived. I don't know if this is technically Bakersfield, but we're still in southeast Bakersfield somewhere. The guys at the deer dealer were really nice, but unfortunately uh, they, they didn't really think we'd be able to get any kind of a tour or a farm visit without any uh, planning ahead of time. So we've only got a few hours here, but uh, now I've got an idea for next time I go somewhere. I'm just gonna call the biggest John Deere dealer nearby and Plan something ahead of time and figure it out Those are the types of trees I had in mind New trees Yeah, they desiccated it and now he's pulling it out and the lifter or whatever they'd call it's coming behind them. Oh, that's some really fine sandy, sandy soil again. Potatoes. Shaking the leaves off the almond trees. Yeah, there's a cab on there. I'd like to walk out there, but no entrance. Lemon trees. Just guessing by the name of the road that maybe that's Bear Mountain ahead of us. Uh, but this road goes back around the north side of the mountain and it looks like it weaves through there for about an hour before we come out on the other side and head to the desert. So we're going to do that. Harvesting oranges. And then my, my short term goal is to find my way to the Kill Bill Church over on the other side of these mountains. Do we have do we winter we survival packs in case we don't make it out of here? Friends and family and let them know where we're headed. <laughs> I need a photo of this. Uh, one of the sales guys at the deer dealer told us, uh, kind of told us how to tell the difference between wine grapes, table grapes, and raisin grapes. You think they are? They're awfully big. Those dry down into raisins? Wow, this is cool. I would bet they're raisin grapes the way they're drying down. Look at this right here. Is it just raisins? That's cool. Sorry. 
The scenery here is entirely different than it is on our south quarter. That is cool. All right, this is it. I hope I get to the end of this video. I think I've raced this road on Mario Kart. I've underestimated the diversity in California. And we only see that around home when it's about 30 below, for the most part. That is crazy. Oh, it is. There's the tunnel that the trains always go through. It's the one. I've never seen railroad tunnels in real life. But I think I remember fighting a guy on the top of a train in Medal of Honor back in eighth grade. Where can I get a beer? Arrived. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for Happy New Year, man. Yeah, you too. Thank you, sweetheart. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's... I believe we're in the Mojave Desert now. More windmills. Edwards Air Force Base. Yeah, that's cool. Here's your warnings. I have a YouTube channel. Can I get a ride in a stealth bomber? In two miles, turn left onto East Avenue G. <laughs> it's the Kill Bill Church. Oh, it's got a truck park right the in front of it. The destination is on your left. Kill Bill Church. Arrived. This is really cool. It's even quieter than I thought and it's too bad they got the truck parked in the way. But it's cool nonetheless. Broken window. A little too high for me to be comfortable reaching in. I gotta try it though. Oh, there it is. Huh? Here we go. Yeah. Here's a good one. Yeah. Warning! U.S. Air Force installation. It is unlawful to enter this area without permission of the installation commander. Do you have permission from the installation commander? I do not. Me neither. That's going to be a beautiful sunset. We're going to jump back over the mountains here, not into the uh, Central Valley, but uh, south of there, back, back into Santa Clarita. And we're going to meet up with a viewer who's got a restaurant there. And hopefully we can stop there and get some burgers or something. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Did you miss us? Yeah?